Hey guys, Brody Swisher here. Welcome back to the channel. And today we're looking at camera arms, tree arms, specifically some of the great new features built into the Fourth Arrow lineup. Now, if you're not familiar with Fourth Arrow camera arms, you need to know that they are one of the heavy hitters that have come on in recent years, bringing a brand new program, platform, whatever you want to call it, to the camera arm industry with features, innovations, unlike anything else. They were really coming out with uh, a desire to be at the forefront with uh, how you put the thing on the tree, how you can lighten the load, how you can adjust it. All those things were built in, kind of taking things to a new level. That's what you'll find with Fourth Arrow. But now they've come up with some new features for 2020 that have kind of answered the demand for a better way. When they came on in the recent years, uh, they were something new, something different, uh, kind of a new twist on camera arms, taking things to the next level. Uh, but they weren't perfect by any means. They weren't perfect. They had some features that were a little frustrating, a little annoying to use. We'll talk about some of those in just a moment. There was some room for improvement. And for 2020, I feel like they've done that with their lineup of new features, specifically talking about the Talon, uh, a new base and shoulder system that's going to help, again, lighten the load for those that want to lighten the pack, uh, getting further back in there, or just don't want to have a, have a heavy load carrying in and out of the tree stems. Now we're gonna talk specifically today about the new Talon base system paired with the 3.0 toolless shoulder system. Now the Talon base system is more compact than anything we've used so far. As the name implies, it's got talons that are gonna grip the tree, but the cool thing about it is those talons fold up to make it more compact. You're gonna see that when you see the side by side of these, how much more compact. It's about a half pound lighter uh, than what we've used in the past, but it's also much more compact. The compactness of it is what's gonna win as you're stashing that down in your pack. Again, we all love to shave a half pound of weight off our load, but the compact design is gonna allow you to stick it down in your pack, your fanny pack, in your pocket, whatever you've got. Super compact when you're talking about the new Talon base. Now for comparison, I wanna give you a closer look at what I've used in the past up until this point. Uh, this is a shoulder system mounted on the run and gun base. Now the run and gun base was designed just for that, for you to run and gun, take it with you, hunt different locations, be mobile. Uh, that's the run and gun base with one of more, uh, the more original shoulder systems. Uh, this is the tool shoulder system we've seen in the past. Again, using the tool is not complicated, it's very simple to use, but it's just the aspect of having something else, an extra tool. And for me, it's really about the noise it sometimes will make. If I clang it, drop it, I oftentimes tuck it in the back here, but you just got that extra metallic sound, something that's not a natural sound in the woods. Again, very simple to use. You simply loosen it up, you can adjust it left, right, up or down, however you need to, side to side, and then you rail it back up, lock it into place. It's ready to go. Again, the tool's there, but it's just that extra clanging and banging that I don't like, and it's an unnecessary step. The guys took that step out of the equation when they came and they built the toolless system here. Again, one screw on the side here is all you're using. You turn it with your fingers, just a big knob, plastic knob on the side. You turn it, you're good to go. Up, down, it adjusts big time all over the place. That's the beauty of the fourth era camera arms. Crooked trees, no problem. If you can get your tree stand in that crooked tree, you're gonna be able to get the fourth era camera arm in there because it's got some super adjustability. No matter what that tree angle throws at you, you can get that arm perfectly level. Your level bubble right here on the top, and you're good to go. Now, when Fourth Arrow first came on the scene, if you remember, they were the company that had the base system you would buy for all your different tree stands. You could buy them fairly affordable, put them in your tree, and leave them there. You simply carried in the arm and the shoulder, mounted it on the base, and you were good to go. You took this in and out with you, but you had uh, bases already put in all your different tree stand locations to make it quick and easy. No ratchet strapping down on the tree the day of the hunt. You had that pre-installed and ready to go, so you simply carried this in, slapped it on the base and you were ready to roll. Now the new 3.0 toolless shoulder and talent base system is an all-in-one compact unit. You bolt them together, they're designed to take with you run and gun style. You're in, you're out, you're taking it with you. Super light, super compact, not one you're gonna leave on the tree. You're taking it with you. It's a run and gun setup. Again, coming in at a pound for the shoulder and base, ultralight arm, it's the ultimate run and gun rig for the mobile hunter. So if you're looking to get started filming hunts this season or just want to upgrade your camera gear, I want to encourage you to be sure to check out the stuff from Fourth Era Camera Arms, specifically the 3.0 toolless shoulder and talon base system. You can't go wrong with this one. Check it out at fourtharacameraarms.com. Hey, we hope to see you back here for more great product reviews, how-tos, lots of great stuff coming up right here. Shoot straight, God bless.